Hi friends, it's Costco time again. In yesterday's video, I shared with you the holiday savings flyer, everything that's on sale right now, as well as half of the toys and all of the Christmas decor that is on sale. I will insert the eye in the upper right hand corner for you to watch that video and I will also leave it in the description box. In today's video, we're gonna go over the rest of the toys, some clothes, some home items, and a few of the other things that they had in Costco. So let's take a look. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below and let me know, are there any particular deals you're wanting to score this holiday season? And if so, which store? Up first, we have this cute bluey ride-on car, it's six volts. Um, I know that they do sell this at Walmart as well, so I will link that in the product description. Not sure if it's cheaper depending on when you see this video, but it's $99 here at Costco. Now this is something I would have wanted as a kid, this fur reel dog it responds to seven commands it barks it's almost like a real dog and i'm really thinking about getting it for my girls since they want a dog so bad but we're just not a dog family anyway this retails for 129.99 leave a comment down below if anybody has this or know someone that has it this how well does it work this life-size doll is 2.8 feet tall, $69.99. They had Moana and Rapunzel, and it came with a little purse and I think a little booklet to it as well. Those are the only two that I saw here at my Costco. And then they had the life-size Connect 4. Well, not life-size, but like extra large Connect 4. Um, it's 40 inches tall. That's something really fun to have, especially over the summertime, um, to do outside at $69.99. It's also great for a basement or parties. I love this little bumper car. I think it's adorable. It's for ages four through nine. It is $159.99. I just think that's a great fun gift. I wish they made them a little bit bigger for my girls, but if they did, that would be such an awesome gift for them. And I don't know if it's like a weight limit, but it just said ages four through nine and you can get either blue and green or pink and purple. Some of the electric scooters out there can range uh, up in the upwards of $500. Here's an affordable, uh, more affordable option at $149.99. This electric scooter is cute, it's nice, it's for kids, um, and this is just a nice option. Now about two weeks ago, these were on sale for $14.99 and it had an asterisk next, next to it, so I didn't think they were gonna restock. They didn't have any left. This is the one that my youngest wanted this particular color. Now they're back at full price. They still have the asterisk at $19.99, but that's a little frustrating. Hopefully it'll go back down um, before the holidays, but honestly, I know she wants it, so I'll probably come back and just buy it for her. If my children still had a playroom, this Lego table would definitely be in it. At $126.99, that's the cheapest that I've seen Lego storage tables like this because the beauty of this table is that they can take the Legos out, play with it, and build on top of the table. Then when you open the table up, there's all these storage bins underneath for the different types of Legos. They can sit on, at this table. There really isn't, there wasn't really many left actually at, the, um, at my particular Costco. But um, like I said, this was very, very helpful. They had all different types of and sizes of storage containers that fit within this table. And again, they can sit and play with it for hours. This Lego Friends Advent Calendar was on clearance, 1997. This is the cheapest I've ever seen the Lego Friends Advent Calendar. You can tell it ends in a seven, and that means that the manufacturer is running this sale. This same Advent Calendar was $39 at Aldi this week and it was $39 at Costco last week, but now, like I said, it's on clearance for $19.97, which is a really good steal. They had some adult Lego sets, $74.99 for this Mona Lisa, which is a little high to me. The poinsettia was $37.99. The Lion King, $99.97, and that's on sale. I don't know if these are collector items or what. Um, they also had Lego Friends, which is the brand, the line that my kids really like a lot. The Castle, um, I think is $69.99, and then the Wicked um, Castle was $79.99. Um, yeah, it seems like Wicked is everywhere. I know that's gonna be a really good movie for this, a really big movie this holiday season, and it's themed literally everywhere. Um, but yeah, that was that was really cool um, to see there. Um, a lot of pieces. Um, it looked like it would be challenging for my girls, so I know that they would really, really like that. Here are all the games that they had for Nintendo Switch. I'm really thinking about getting that Mario Party for 
Ava because she wants a Nintendo Switch Lite. They had a PS5, $579.99. Um, PS5s are just what they are. PS5 is very expensive. They had Madden 25 on clearance uh, for the Xbox and the PS5, $39.99. I know that's really cheap because usually this game will run you over $50. There was literally only one left for each of those at my Costco. This cute, super cute VTech karaoke machine. I love it. I love the little disco part on top. Something for fun for the kids to play. That was $49.99 and there was also an asterisk next to that. So that means, you know, they claim they're not gonna get a restock, but you never know. They didn't have many left of this acoustic guitar for $169.99. This was currently on sale at Costco as well as that drum set next to it. Basketball, $19.99. Again, with the asterisk next to it, that's a nice gift. I'm not sure if they were women's basketball or just a standard men's basketball or a standard women's size, I'm not sure. Now, this is really cute. This is like a Lululemon dupe of the popular belt bag that they have. They had it only in two colors, cream and black with like the fuzzy material on the top. That's a great stocking stuffer. Those were $14.99 each. Here they have the popular Frigidaire Nugget Ice Maker. Now this isn't the very expensive GE one that you find all the influencers on Instagram talking about. That's $500. This is a very nice Nugget Ice Maker. Leave a comment down below if you use this before, if you have it, if you like it. Right now it's on sale for $169.99. At Walmart, these are normally $199.99. So it's a good deal here at Costco this week. A nice weekender bag here for $49.99. It came in two colors, black and cream. Looked like there's like a faux leather at the bottom and then like a regular material, bag material up at the top that you can zip, top it on top of your suitcase for vacay. Now this is a great buy that I'm actually thinking about going back to get for our house. It is the Shark Mess Master wet and dry vacuum and it's only $69.99. I really wonder how good this works. Leave a comment down below and let me know if you have this. I haven't heard much about this online, but the sheer fact that it's $69.99 will make me wanna just try it. I think it would be great for just spills, for to use on your car. Those are all the tools that it comes with. And I just think it would be helpful when you're trying to wash your car out. Cause right now we don't have like a handheld vac like this one. This is the one I had that broke on me after two years. I bought it on sale for $79.99. It will be on sale in the next couple of weeks, $20 off. But to me, it's just a better deal to just get that wet dry vac by Shark um, because it's so much cheaper and then you get more tools and you can do more stuff with it. Here's a Gourmia air fryer. I like this type of air fryer because I feel like you can cook a lot more in it. It's very big, but it's also an air fryer that you can't like easily take in and out. Like you'd probably have to just keep that on your counter. That's $119.99. So it takes up like valuable counter space in my opinion, but it is very nice and you can use it pretty much for anything. Then they had $5 off this nice cutting board. I've seen this herringbone cutting board in there for several, several weeks now, and now it's on sale for $19.99. Would be great for a charcuterie board, for a holiday party of some sort, or a serving tray of some sort. It's very nice. Now they have these special, specialty knife set, and I might go back and get this because I need some new knives badly. Um, I like this three set here. It could just easily fit in my drawers, my knife drawers. Um, and it looks like it's nice quality, stainless steel knives for $19.99. Then they had some oven mitts that were currently on sale, $11.99. I think these are by KitchenAid, but they only had two colors. They had navy and gray only. They have these really nice serving utensils, really nice quality. They're a very heavy duty stainless steel. These were on clearance for $15.99. I just thought that was a really good steal. I don't need any, but if you need some, this was a really good deal. Then they had this wire basket that was on clearance for $9.97. I can't tell if it's stackable, and I didn't couldn't tell if I actually liked it or not, but it was on clearance for $9.97. Simple Modern 40 ounce tumblers they had on sale for $17.99. They only had these three colors, red, green, and cream. I really love the red. They also had these bent, bent go uh, lunch boxes still on clearance for $14.97. Um, if your child likes to uh, 
take their lunch for school, this is a really good deal because these are normally around $20 on Amazon. How cute are these dainty glass bowls with the nicest embellishment around them? It looks like they come in two different colors, just clear glass and a green color. These are on clearance for $19.99, not bad at all. And again, super nice. I'm curious if they have these in every state that there's a Costco in because my, of course I live in Georgia and Atlanta, the Metro Atlanta area, and they have a Georgia one, but I'm curious of the other states where they have the state cutting board. Uh, does it look accurate? Ours looks pretty accurate. Uh, do you have it? Leave a comment down below and let me know. I love this rug. This is the exact rug that I have in my foyer area. I got mine on sale for $34.99 uh, several months ago. We absolutely love it. It's the perfect, perfect size for my foyer. Nice quality as well. Then they have these really nice quality throws. Um, and these are everyday use throws, not just for the holidays, $19.99. I have the cream bath mats. We have been absolutely loving them in my bathroom, $12.99. It feels so comfortable on the feet. $24.97 for these cute kids Nike jackets. These are on clearance. Here are the colors that they had. Um, they have this um, sprinkle and then looks like tie-dye in a purple color. Really super cute. Then the cutest DKNY little outfit set, $12.99 for that chenille set. Love that. And here's the jacket that I was thinking about getting my girls. Uh, they run a little bit small in my opinion, so I would definitely size up if you're thinking about getting it. I did not buy it for my girls because they seemed pretty short in the torso area and I just don't think it would fit them well, but $9.99, you can't beat it. They had this Disney Princess Advent Calendar for $22.99. It came with four Mashems collectibles. I'm not sure what that is. But then the rest of the stuff was just like assorted candy, like nerds or gummy worms or something like that. So I personally didn't think it was really worth the $22.99, but they did have it there. This holiday mingle mix looked so delicious on sale for $9.49. It looks like they had a Reese's peanut butter cups in there. Just something really yummy. How cute is this nut or cracker container? I think there were cookies in there. I love that they came in all shades and hair colors and stuff. These were on sale for $10.99. Also, there's an asterisk next to it. Then they had color a treat. These, uh, you can, you get three cookies to color on, I guess with edible markers. Those were $11.99, which is something different than the gingerbread house. This super soft faux fur throw felt so soft and yummy in the store. It was on sale for $24.99. I wish they had more colors. They just had it in this chocolate. I had no idea that Costco sold the Peloton bike. Leave a comment down below and let me know, is this price good? It's $19.99. Um, I'm assuming it's cheaper than going to peloton.com to buy it, but I was really shocked to see such a huge name brand in here um, for sale at Costco. Yeah, $19.99.99. So they're getting ready for after the holidays and all the fitness equipment and stuff like that. For literally a quarter of the price, you can get this Nordic, Nordic Track stand, stationary bike for $4.99.99. And then they also had this Echelon Stair Stepper seems like stair stepper sport for $399.99. I've never seen an outdoor patio heater so cheap at $99.99. That's definitely a steal. And then they also had like a faux fireplace type heater for $99.99. That was nice as well. The price of hot tubs as well as everything else has gotten to be so outrageous. I completely understand a blow up hot tub or a portable spa $4.99.99, you can use it seasonally. This is a great gift for the person in your life that's not quite yet a Costco lover. $65 for a full year's membership, that's a lot cheaper. Then they had these cookies. These cookies were the tin, you know, the butter cookies, like we all grew up with these tin cans and the butter cookies or shortbread cookies, I should say. And, um, you know, my Nana had one, my aunts and my great, great aunts had one and they would always use them for different things, but we always had these cookies on the table. Now the container spins, which is really cool. It's like a fancy version. Oh, these are so adorable. Grinch themed cookie jars. 
1999 super adorable they didn't have much left and it does have an asterisk next to it and then they had a gingerbread decorating kit 11.99 i think i might go back and get that you only get three gingerbreads but honestly it's better than those big houses that take up so much space um and they make a mess uh, it seems like the gingerbread decorating kits might be easier this Sugar Fina candy bento box was $39.99. Apparently this is a luxury candy brand. Very, very pricey as you could see, $39.99 for just those few samples of the candy. And then they had the Salted Caramels Girl, $8.99. When I tell you, these are so good. That dark chocolate and that sea salt, mm-mm-mm, delicious. This foil is usually $19.99, but they did hike the price up just a bit um, to take the $5 off to bring it down to $17.69. So it is still cheaper than normal. So if you do need foil, now is the time, especially through the holidays. While I was at Costco, I saw several people buy this utility card. I guess it's useful. You could use it in a kitchen, in a craft room, in a bedroom, in a bathroom. $54.99 for that. But like I said, I saw several people buying that. If you need a six foot table, this is on sale right now. And I believe this is adjustable as well. $47.99, great for the holidays when you're having people, extra people over. They had this Tommy Bahama chair, which felt like it was infl inflatable, like it was inflated. $59.99, not sure how useful that would be though when you're out needing a chair. Then they had the storage cubicle, $99.99. I have this, we still use it in the darker color. I bought it here from here years ago. So that was a good price. Then they had $100 off of this viral TikTok find, Costco find, $399.99, great for a bedroom. And then for the chocolate, hot chocolate lover in your life, 50 pack Swiss Miss, $5.99. This same exact uh, box is on sale at Sam's as well. So here are the last two big sales that I have not seen since before COVID. Goolsby Sausage, $6.99. I have not seen it this cheap since before COVID. My older daughter loves this sausage. It's her favorite type. And so we have it quite a bit. Again, I hadn't seen it that cheap. As well as the oatmeal bread, $3.99 for two loaves. Again, haven't seen these prices since before COVID. So I was really happy to catch some of our favorites on sale. All right, y'all, I'm back home. Let me quickly show you what I got. I'm looking like, what the heck did I just spend my money on? So this is everything I got from Costco. I want you to guess, leave a comment down below and guess how much it was. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight items. And I want you to guess, okay? So of course I have got the heavy whipping cream because listen, I love it in my coffee. So does my husband. It's an everyday thing for us. I got some more honey because we were all out. The Goolsby sausage because it was on sale. I haven't seen it this low since before COVID at $6.99. I got some Tostitos scoops for us to have nachos tonight. Well, I won't be having nachos because I'm eating ketogenically, but everyone else will. I did get the Lego. I only got one because I don't know if I don't know if Zara, my almost 13 year old, is gonna want an advent calendar, but I will ask her. And if she wants one, I will get her, go back and get her one. Then I got the bread, which was on sale for $3.99 for both loaves. Again, I haven't seen it that cheap in a really, really long time because this is now almost $6 for both loaves. And then the most expensive thing I got was the ground beef. Ground beef is incredibly expensive now. I mean, it's, it's astronomical at this point. And then I got some organic gala apples. Altogether, I spent a grand total of $90.15. Where? I mean, yeah, the ground beef was almost $30 and then the advent calendar was 20. So that's like $50 right there. I swear these prices just get more and more expensive, but that is it. My friends, I will be going back to Costco next week. Um, because again, the flyer goes all month long through to the beginning of December. So I just want to see what else they have. Maybe some more things will go on clearance. So we'll be going to Costco every week. I won't be buying something every week, but just go in for just to, for us to just see what they have and what they're offering. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.